up everybody it's your boy named Jarvis Davis here bringing out this video and golly this one is called how to break up with girlfriend hashtag or uh, at hot twin let's see what's up the fuck was that <laughs> what the fuck you said what the fuck was that Pop that bitch out. <laughs> Title of this email How to Break Up with Girlfriend. It's easy enough. Look, man, this is what you do, man. When she goes to work, pack up all your shit and move out. <laughs> That's how you do it. True. Look That's true. Email. Fuck the bullshit. You got a lot of shit have a fucking U Haul truck. <laughs> Park it down the street, though, as soon as she leaves. You call out of work, pack up all your shit, and leave. Leave, yeah. Hey, Keith and Kevin, my best friend has a crazy girlfriend who is a complete jerk to him. A uh, girl is a jerk? You don't call girls jerks. You call them a bitch. Yeah, guys are jerks. Yeah. Guys are jerks. Girls are bitches. <laughs> yeah. That's where it's always been, man. That's the, and I didn't make that, I didn't make that rule. So don't. So don't be no. mad at us. Don't be mad at me. That's, that's just life, man. It's just it's life. Just life. Is, that's real. It's just how shit goes. Man. Yeah, it's just how shit is, man. Get over it. <clears throat> Telling him what to... Okay, she's a complete jerk, a.k.a. bitch to him. Telling him what to do and never, and never, never lets him do anything without her permission. It sounds like a bitch to me. It's a bitch, man. It's that joke. is a bitch. You when, you when you think of a bitch... Yeah. That's a bitch right there, man. That's all kinds of bitches. All kinds. And anytime really we want to hang out, kind of he got to ask man. her for permission. Man, that's mm -hmm. a bitch, man. God damn, man. It's another bitch flag. She seems like a pretty big bitch to me. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? What the hell? She that boy like a slave. I think slaves had it better than this motherfucker. <laughs> um... <laughs> I don't think so, man. Motherfucker, they used to fuck some slaves up. She mean to him and makes him buy junk for her, and it keeps him constantly stressed out because he has to put up with her bull. He told me he's thought about breaking man, up with her. Man, you blocking me with the fucking phone. <laughs> All you see is your face and phone in my eyes. How about, how about him? <laughs> there you go. Law. Right. Right there. Need to wash my face. Looks... Looks greasy. You know, <laughs> oh, that nigga, nice. that nigga in them. What the hell? This is my first time reacting to them, man. He told me he started about breaking up with her, but her only living family is her mom, who's mean to her and doesn't care about her. And he told me whenever he doesn't talk to her, she has suicidal thoughts. Huh? Why the fuck did he even get with this uh, girl? Yeah. She's a bitch. She's crazy. Her mama's fucking crazy. Yeah. You gotta know these things before you. Get with somebody. Yeah, if you yeah. Wanna, if you first start dating a girl, go see a mama. Yeah. You'll learn all about this girl within five minutes. You go to that house, her fucking mama's fucking just batshit crazy. She batshit crazy. Yeah. yeah. Cause the uh, what's the saying? What's how that old saying go? The apple doesn't fall far. Uh, fuck, fuck. The that. apple doesn't fall far from the tree. Yeah, <laughs> the I had that. <laughs> well, say it. Say it. Fuck it. Say it! The apple, right? It doesn't roll too far from the tree. No, it's the apple doesn't fall too far from the tree. <laughs> I like the way I said it. No, that's the ghetto way of saying it. Say it the right way. No, the ghetto way of saying the apple don't that's fall. That's fucking plagiarism what you did. You just stole somebody's fucking quote and made it your own. That's some bullshit right there. Okay, um... <laughs> What should I do? His relationship is terrible and it keeps him stressed and locked up on a chain being whipped. <laughs> Why the fuck you even worried about it? Hey look man, what's that um what's that um that science motherfucker? What do you say? Science motherfucker. Yeah, well um Darwinism. Survival of the fittest. That's how that's if you fit to survive, you will survive. You're gonna be more fit to survive without her, right? What I mean your friend is. Your friend's gonna be more fit to survive, and see, she's not gonna be able to survive. She's probably gonna end up fucking killing herself. Problem solved. Shit's over and done with. It's gonna happen sooner or later. She's probably gonna end up, if she's that fucking depressed and crazy, 
Yeah. They got some crazy people in this world, y'all. You gotta watch no, shit out. That man. kind of shit happens if she if he stays with her. The clock is ticking on your friend, my friend. Cause they don't get uh, less crazy as they get older. They, they get, get more fucking crazier and crazier and crazier. Till one day she will come out of a goddamn frying pan full of goddamn hot boiled chicken. She gonna pour that goddamn greasy Ooh, chicken. Ooh, when you sleep. Ooh. Yeah. They gonna see what's going on. It's gonna Damn. be one of them old cast iron skillets, and she gonna crack that motherfucker inside his head and bust his head wide the fuck open, and then he's gonna bleed to death and got and his face all fried the fuck yeah. up. Oh. Not that, that the fucking grease was, the grease was bad enough, but, you know, crazy, but she's got to hit you with that cast iron skillet. Yeah. She got to crack you upside your fucking skull with it. Hey, look, man. Just tell him he needs to break away. He needs to call her crazy-ass mama up, say, look, he's crazy. <laughs> yeah. Look here, in all seriousness, your girl, your daughter, shit ain't working out. I got to move on. I'm just letting you know this because Hold I'm gonna, on, man. Hold on, shut the get fuck up. Get this motherfucking kill. Why you got to bring the mama in on it? Man, that's the only family she's got. So let me finish. Why you gotta tell her mama though, man? Yeah, that's hey, what I wanna they know. Gonna, they gonna fucking team up. They gonna kill this motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> that nigga so said they gonna kill. Then you give your goddamn advice. <laughs> right now I'm giving my fucking advice. You get this motherfucker killed, man. She said she look here. Come over here. Let's talk about. It. I got a nice slice of apple pie. He gonna get there, then that girl's gonna be in the fucking corner, a hot fucking skillet of grease, <laughs> she gonna throw it on, and then her mama gonna take the goddamn skillet and crack his fucking head on. Look here, man, in all seriousness, look here. You gotta let this girl go, man, before she takes you both down. Look here. You go over and let her mom know. Call her ass on the phone and say, look, I say don't tell shut me. Shut the fuck up! And let me give the goddamn advice till you give no advice. <laughs> look here, man. <laughs> Call up on the phone, cause like you said, the bitch is probably the, she crazy like a damn daughter. Call up on the phone and say, look, your daughter, sweet girl and all, shit ain't working out. Right? I'm gonna dump her ass today. I'm gonna dump her as soon as I hang up with your ass. I'm letting you know because when I dump her, I think she's gonna fucking kill herself. And then you ain't no blood on your hands. Go bitch. Ain't no blood on his hands anyway, bitch crazy. <laughs> Look here, man. Get the fuck. Be you careful who you mess with, yeah, man. Seriously. Shit, right. Park that shit on the end of the fucking street, right? <laughs> act like everything's fucking cool, man. <laughs> when everybody go to work, you act like you going to work. All you really doing is sucking on the goddamn fucking. Uh, <laughs> and we'll wait for that crazy bitch to leave. Once you said crazy bitch pull off, you going there? Have you bought fucking stop by the Home Depot? <laughs> you about five workers, right? You better pack your shit up within seconds, right? Yeah. Take your shit and move on with your life. Yeah. You can leave her a note saying, hey, sorry about this shit. Uh, shit ain't working out. Bye. Oh! <laughs> Demon got me. Oh! What the hell? Demon's sucking me off. Oh! Fit the cold. Oh! What the fuck? Oh! Wow. Like I said before, wow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> that was a lot of cussing though, y'all. Golly. Wow. How do y'all think of my first reaction of this? You know, because they, I give them credit. They do got some crazy people and psycho people in this world, y'all. Hold on. Real talk. Be careful who you mess with, because you never know. They can have a gun. They can have anything. A knife, machete, chainsaw. Just be careful. Alright? Because a person would come in your house. Now, when I would come in your house, definitely when you sleep. When you sleep, that's where you messed up at. They'll catch you when you sleep. Because they will do some crazy stuff. At least that's being said. Original link will be in, in the description. And also, make sure you like, share, and subscribe, and comment. And I'm out. Thank you for watching. Peace.